क्लास फाइव सोशल स्टडीज लेसन नंबर थ्री लाइफ इन डेजर्ट्स एंड फॉरेस्ट रीजन्स हेयर यू कैन सी अ लिस्ट ऑफ टेन लार्जेस्ट डेजर्ट्स देयर लोकेशन टाइप एंड एरियाज दे कवर ऑन दी अर्थ यूजली ऑल डेजर्ट्स हैव ड्राई क्लाइमेट इन कोल्ड डेजर्ट द टेम्परेचर रिमेन्स बिलो फाइव डिग्रीज ड्यूरिंग विंटर्स इन हॉट डेजर्ट्स द टेम्परेचर राइजेज अप टू सिक्सटी डिग्रीज so during the day the land heats up very quickly and at night the heat escapes quickly too winds in deserts are usually dry and dusty they make life very uncomfortable sometimes there are whirlwinds and sometimes there are sandstorms so when there is a sandstorm the sand is blown all over the place so the sand is not always flat crescent shaped dunes are formed by the wind about 1/5 of the earth's land surface is desert some deserts are caused by too much cultivation when good fertile land is used for too long too many trees are cut down or all the water is used up so deserts are formed in such places even when animal grazing and, and they eat uh, vegetation so the land becomes barren in middle east there are dry river beds which are called wadis valley Sometimes in the middle of a desert, there is a source of water. Uh, it can be a spring or a water hole, and trees are planted around it. You can find trees there, so a small settlement will also be there. That area is known as an oasis. Vegetation in desert is very different from the plants that you see around. so desert plants have few leaves and thick fleshy stems the roots of desert plants spread very far in search of water animals like lizards snakes scorpions foxes hedgehogs insects and birds live in the deserts in australia there are kangaroos and wallabies found both look alike but they are not same they are different the human population of desert region is very low the harsh climate lack of vegetation and water and the mostly undeveloped land do not attract a lot of people to settle there so it's very difficult to live in a desert do you know there is a country which lies entirely inside a desert the name of that country is saudi arabia now it is one of the most developed countries in the middle east oil is the source of energy for industry transport and power so saudi arabia basically sells its oil all over the world and in some parts of the country there is cultivation also done where their land is fertile so not whole of the country but some places so they do, they do not have any large rivers so what do do what are they doing for the fresh water they desalinate sea water to make it fresh to be used by their people so working in a desert is very uncomfortable as it is very hot less trees for shade and it's it's very difficult so in saudi arabia the oil companies have set up well equipped and comfortable housing colonies with modern facilities for their workers so that they can work there peacefully otherwise it's a hot country it's a dry country as it lies inside a desert but today it is a modern one